this person who's going to win as a vice mayor will be working with me for a year and a half. So that makes a lot of, of difference. Uh, I hope that the people of Agat will come out and support who they feel can do the job. On June 6, a special election is being held for Agate Vice Mayor following the passing of Augustin Quintaniza in April. A total of five people are running for the position, all of whom Agate Mayor Carol Tayama says make for a strong list of candidates. People have asked me, who do you want? I can work with anybody. I think it's, it's up to them to decide who they feel can do the job as a vice mayor. The two running under the Democratic ticket are Derek Baza Hills and Jermaine Alerta. Under the Republican banner are Rowen and Malaga, Joseph Benny Salas, and Kevin Sesuico. We have a lot of young ones that uh, have decided to, uh, to take the challenge, so that's good. Yes. Yeah. And, and next year will be the general election for, for uh, mayor and vice mayor. Tayama says part of that challenge the new vice mayor will have is helping her address several issues plaguing the village, including the stray dog problem, improvements to sports facilities, and repairs to the roads. And I know that I've been working on the roads, and it's not easy to try to get the funding because those are federal funds that we try to secure, and, and the governor has been helping us. It's just that, uh, you know, we're not the only village on the island, so... We can only do so much. Tayama says whoever does win for vice mayor will gain the experience and background to possibly lead the village in the future as she will not seek re-election next year after over a decade on the job. I'm looking forward to working to, with whoever wins because we have a lot of work ahead of us and uh, it being my last term. I want, I want to uh, make sure that everything is in place. The special election, meanwhile, will take place on the same day as the village's main event, the Agate Mango Festival. The election was initially set for May, but was postponed due to Typhoon Dolphin. While she had initially wanted a vice mayor elected before the festival, Tayama hopes the people will come out for both events. It's a lot of work, and I wanted to work with the vice mayor, but it didn't happen. So uh, I'm hoping that the, the community will come out, vote, and then come and attend our, our events. It's, it's scheduled for June 6 and 7. So we're hoping for, you know, having a, a, a successful mango festival event. With the storm that ha just happened, uh, <laughs> you know, I know that a lot of the mangoes have been destroyed, but, we're, you know, nevertheless, we're still going to have. There are currently over 2,321 registered voters in Agate. The special election again is set for June 6th from 7 a.m. to 8 p.m. at Ocean View Middle School. Reporting for Guam's News Network, I'm Ken Quintaniza.